Hi Mouse, hi Von Yipu, hi whoever you are. So today we are doing a story time. My phone just buzzed and made me jump. But today we are doing a bit of a story time-ish. It, it's a story video, okay? It's a short story. Something that happened today it is the 23rd of April 2019 and I'm gonna tell you this story and like let me know if this lighting is working for me or if I just look dead thanks so I've got my notes here so it's not a rambly mess although let's be honest probably still will be and like first of all look how cute I got this bear today and I like, actually love him like he, he is just so cute anyway <laughs> let's go story begins I was sat at a desk, right, doing some work. I wasn't sat, I was stood. I remember I was stood at a desk and I was, I had these, okay, I'm gonna paint a scene for you. Imagine a desk, a chair behind me and the desk has like two shelves and it's like a light wood and there's a bunch of stuff on the different shelves of this desk, right? And then I've got sticky labels on the desk, a pen, and a stack of CDs, okay? And so I'm basically taking the sticky labels off, sticking them on the CDs and writing. And I've also got a cup of tea underneath the desk. Now this is very important, okay? Underneath the desk it was on the first shelf okay so it's a two desk shelf and it was on the first shelf and it was underneath tucked away under the desk okay remember this so i'm doing my work taking the sticky label off sticking it on the cd writing on it and it's in a massive pile of cds and i'm doing that and i'm just taking the label off right writing the thing and then suddenly so I'm stood there and I'm writing on the label and suddenly, just out of nowhere, this like spray of liquid just flies everywhere. And I'm like, what? Hello? Demons? Huh? Because literally, just this spray of liquid just comes out of nowhere and I'm like, um, droplets everywhere of this like dingy like water like this dingy tea coloured water and so my first thought is I look at the ceiling like leak because <laughs> it literally just just like that like every droplets everywhere all over the desk all over the label and I was thinking is this like drop from the ceiling but nothing was leaking and then I thought this is tea coloured tea coloured so I was like my cup of tea but I look under the desk and my cup of tea is undisturbed no droplets around it whatsoever my cup of tea is just chilling okay my cup of tea had nothing to do with this so I'm thinking how the hell did tea splashes get on the desk when nothing's leaking from the ceiling and my cup of tea is chill like it's showing no signs of a spillage so I'm like and it's under the desk this this occurred on top of the desk and tea is under the desk so I'm freaking out a bit like um they're gonna think I spilled tea everywhere so I go over to someone and I'm like literally droplets just like sprayed from nowhere and I don't know what this liquid is, but it looks like tea coloured. And so we clear up the liquid and we just decide maybe I maybe I like somehow dropped something in my tea and it just sprayed on top of the desk. Cause that's obviously human. Not human. Possible. That's obviously obviously the tea just jumped from underneath the desk onto the top of the desk. Like that is clearly what happened. So I go back to work and I'm writing on the label, just 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 chilling, just writing on the label. And then suddenly, out of nowhere, there's a droplet on my label. And I'm like, 
What? I, I moved my tea, okay? My tea was not the culprit. My tea was further under the desk, so it was literally impossible for my tea to be causing this droplet. So I'm like, what the actual hell is going on? So the label's ruined because it's got a droplet on it of tea, so I take the label off and I just start to write another one. Ding! And I'm thinking, um, what? So I get a bit freaked out. So I try again. And then I realise, is, wait, wait, but, 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 is my pen leaking tea? <laughs> is my pen leaking tea? <laughs> and my pen had been nowhere near my cup of tea. Literally, my pen and my tea had never come into contact before. Like, they, as far as my pen and my tea know, they don't exist. Like, that's how much they didn't come into contact with each other. If, if the tea and the pen were people, they'd be complete strangers. So I'm thinking, sh surely, surely not. Surely not. So I start writing, and sure enough, I start writing in tea. At least I think it's tea. It was tea-coloured. It didn't look like tea, but it was like a, it was like a tea-coloured water. So... I'm just like, it's like, you know when you make a cup of tea and it's like before you put the milk in, but lighter. That's what I mean. So I'm like, what the hell? This is, d d d d my pen is writing tea. It was coming out the end of the thing. And when I'd stop writing, it would just suck back into the little pointy bit. And I'm just thinking, ghosts? Stop messing with me. <laughs> but no, in all seriousness, I was a bit like, what actually happened? So I go over to these people and I'm like, you're, I'm not even kidding. You're gonna think I'm kidding. My pen is leaking tea. <laughs> and I sounded so stupid. But I showed them on the label. I was like, my pen is leaking tea. <laughs> Only me, guys. Only my pen would leak tea. So anyway, that is my story. Um, let me know what you think. Pretty weird, huh? Maybe a bit paranormal. Maybe the demons and ghosts are messing with me. Maybe they just really wanted me to write in tea. Maybe the pen had already come into contact with somebody else's tea. But then I think they would have binned it if that were the case. Anyway, and let me just clear up, the pen was writing perfectly fine before. No tea droplets until after the big splash. But yeah, that is all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe to Become a Maddle to join our quest for madness. Give this video a like if you want. Tell me if you want more of these miniature stories, because my life is pretty weird. And until next time, I'm Madal Adamundan. I never say that. And goodbye. Goodbye. Have a lovely day. Okay, so let's try and get this correct. I'm gonna have a good angle. I think the camera's too angled and too far away. Can you guys hear me? Hello. <laughs> also, video notes because being organised is good. Also, Rainbow Bear, look how cute! I love him, I love him so much. And like, in all pink. He's got one of my favourite jumpers on. And he got pink pyjama bottoms on. Because we got to get comfy for this story time, even though I'm boiling, I'm actually melting, guys. Like, oh my god, help me. Let's try some lighting. Eh. Ghost story. Oh, oh, that's too bright. Is this lighting looking good or do I just look ugly? Let me know. <laughs> Wait, do I need another setting? It's gonna flash if I do that, isn't it? Wait. Hi, Mouse. Hi, people. Hi, people. Hi, whoever you are. So, today, 